What is up guys, Smudgebeans here and welcome back to the Subscriber City Challenge! Yes, we are back in our Subscriber City world and yes, I may sound a little bit different. It is because I have a cold currently. I am under the weather and feeling like poop, but I'm still making this video for you guys because I do enjoy making this series. So, I made a video the other day saying things are going to change a little bit in Subscriber City Challenge 2016 and what I've decided after a long debate with myself is that I'm just going to get rid of the rooms idea for now. We may bring it back later on, but for now, I'm just going to get rid of it because it makes my world lag so much. Like over here, I get a nice 60 frames per second. You can see the video is smooth, but once it gets to here, you can see the visual difference and how bad it gets. The Like the more rooms there are, the laggier it is. It's just not very nice and it's just ruining the experience for me especially when I have to build and it's all choppy and stuff so I'm just going to cut out the rooms idea for now but don't worry we will be adding more houses we are going to be doing five houses per episode which is five comments from you guys and the building is the bit I enjoy more I feel like the rooms they're just too small most of the time to do anything interesting and creative with it and I just rather build the houses so I'm gonna do five houses and make them epic and spectacular each time and Put more effort into them. So yes, let's get into the first comment for this episode. So the first comment comes from Amazing Candle. They say, hey Joel, can you please build me a giant grandfather clock? It would be so incredible to see you build it. In-game name, Anithma. Anithma. An I, I don't know how. Anithma. I don't know how to pronounce that. But yes, I will bend your bill. Bend? Build your grandfather clock. I've been clearing out some space here for you. So let's get building that. When I use world edit to take away the trees and clear the land, this is actually what it looks like. I just delete all the leaves at first, then I delete all the trees as well, and it is crazy how many like trees and leaves that I delete at once. It almost crashes my Minecraft. Like, watch this. Look how long that takes. 21,000 blocks, and it was over 189,000 for those. That's crazy. Okay, so I hope you enjoyed that little time lapse there of the grandfather clock. I tried to muddle it off this one here a bit, so it looks kind of similar to that. So let me know what you think. I'm pretty happy with it. I think it looks really cool if we go back all the way over here. Look at that big grandfather clock for you there. So I hope you like that. And Frima, or however you pronounce your name. So yeah, let's move on to build number two of today. And we have a comment from Ashley Lowe, and she says, Can you make a giant lightsaber in honor of the new Star Wars movie? My skin is a fop girl, and my username is Whisper24, so sure thing, I can make a massive lightsaber. Now, that's a long and thin one, so we can put that in some sort of unique place. We're going to place that on top of this hill over here, so let's get building. <laughs> Okay, so we have finished the lightsaber, and you may have thought during that time that's... Ooh, is it going to be a red lightsaber? But no, of course, it's a green one. So, Whisper24, here you are. I don't know why all the NPCs are looking down recently. Like, Anfrima was doing the same. But there you go, here's your lightsaber. It actually looks really cool at night. Look at that, it's all lit up at night as well. Although, I don't know why these blocks... That's a little glitch. There you go. So there is a lightsaber. That looks really cool. So I hope you like that. And let's move on to number three of today. So next up we have a comment from Jazzy Sky. And they say, hi Joel. I was wondering if you could make me an Australian flag. My name is Aussie Pug. I love you. Thanks. So sure thing. We can do that. So we're going to build the Australian flag just over here. Let's say... Yes, there's a bit of raised land here which I'm going to use, so let's get building this. Okay, so I finished Aussie Pug's build. You can actually see it all the way up on here. 
If you look closely, there they are. You can see how big this flag is. Aussie Pug is standing on top. And here is their Australian flag, which is huge and ridiculous. Uh, so I hope you enjoy it. Uh, it's massive. It takes up so much space. It's crazy. So that is the third build of today. I hope you like that. So we've got the lightsaber, the grandfather clock, and the Aussie flag. And now we are going to move on to the fourth, which has a comment from... Claire Powell, and they say, Hi Joel, I was wondering if you could make me a massive popcorn bag house. I don't have an in-game name, so I can have a unicorn skin. With my name being Jazzy Jesse. So sure thing, we can do a popcorn bag for you. We'll do that over here somewhere. Let's get building it. Okay, so here is house number four. We have got the popcorn. So... I just went for a sort of simple popcorn here in this corner. I think it really looks quite cool. Got some. Oh, there's, we missed a bit. There's a, there's a hole there. Shh, that's not gonna, that's not going to be there. Let's just let's shh. Okay, so yes, we've got Jazzy Jessie down here in her unicorn skin. I hope this skin's okay for you. Why is she looking down? Why is everyone looking down? Everyone seems so sad. Uh, we've got a nice little garden there as well to add to the atmosphere. So that is a nice little addition to our build, which is awesome. And for the final build of today, we have a suggestion from Jade Sanchez, and she says, In case you're not doing the winter theme, can you build giant sunglasses since it represents New Year's? This is the first Subscriber City Challenge after New Year's, so I thought this suitable. My game name is Jade the Jedi Skin Girl Penguin. Okay, so let's get building the sunglasses. <laughs> Okay, so I have finished the sunglasses. I wasn't really sure what to do with the fawn here, so I just left it for glass, grass for now, even. Uh, but Jade the Jedi stood in the middle of them, looking out. I think it's quite cool that they look out over that way, into the world, uh, away from all the crazy stuff that's happening behind it. But yeah, I think it looks really cool. Pretty happy with those sunglasses. In fact, I might change it just one little bit. I changed them slightly. You may notice I just changed that corner, that corner, and the middle bit as well. I think they look a bit better now. That's, 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 I'm happy with that. Okay, but yes, that is all five builds for today. So we have the sunglasses, the popcorn, the lightsaber, the Australian flag, which is ginormous, and the grandfather clock, which is also pretty ginormous, to be honest. Uh, so yes, I hope you enjoyed this episode, guys. Make sure to leave a comment down below with a build design. I feel like I can be more creative with the build design, so that's why I'm doing this. Even though it does take me quite a while. Like, for example, that Australian flag took an hour alone to build. But yes, I hope you enjoyed it. Make sure to leave those comments down below. And I'll see you another time for another video. Goodbye!